Welcome to Eric Blackman Music. Hi, and welcome to Let's Talk Scales. The guitar is tuned E, A, D, G, B, E, or standard tuning. And today, we're going to be talking about the secrets of the pentatonic scale. Now, when I say secrets, what I mean is we're going to talk about the things that guitarists don't typically know about the pentatonic scale. First, Let's go to the A minor pentatonic scale, which we play quite a bit, and we're going to start at the 5th fret on the low E string. We're going to play this scale the way most people play it, this way. Now if we look at the notes, the notes are A, C, D, E, G, A, and they repeat A, C, D, E, G, A. That's A minor pentatonic. Now, if we were to play C major pentatonic, which is actually in the same key, we start with the C note and play it this way. Starting with C, we play C, D, E, G, A, C, like that. And it gives us a little bit of a different sound, but we're still in the same key. Now, one of the secrets of the pentatonic scale is that they're on one fret. We can play the very same thing on that fret right there. The first note is A. Then we have D, G, C, E, and then A again. So the pentatonic scale is right there. Now as for me, the moment I discovered that all the pentatonic notes were on that fret, it changed the way I play. Since all the notes, like this, were available to me here, I started changing the way that I struck the notes. I started using these notes this way. And it gave me new ideas in the way I would solo. Instead of just running up and down the scale like this. I started playing this way. because I knew that the same notes were available to me right there on that one fret. Now I've got one of my Band in the Box backing tracks ready to play and I'm going to play some notes here and then I'm going to play some notes the normal way that we play the pentatonic scale, okay? And compare those ways. Here we go. Let's play the scale as we normally do. One fret. Normally. One fret. As you can see, 
see there, just simply knowing that I could get away with playing on that one fret changed the ideas that I had about playing my solo. I was able to do the normal thing and then do some creative things. So with these options, I can change the sound of my solo at will. This is a really great creative tool to know that you can get away with notes on one fret and then revert back to the normal way that we play the pentatonic scale. Well, all right. That's it for this episode of Let's Talk Scales. Thanks for stopping by and have a great day.